It is a beautiful day in Boston and the boys of summer are back. Sports Team 10's Joe Kayot is live at Fenway Park for opening day. Joe? Hey Allison, yeah, opening day and it's a beauty here at Fenway Park as the Red Sox kick off their home schedule back in Boston and what a day it is for a little baseball as they will host the Washington Nationals at 3 o'clock this afternoon on Ness and coverage starts at 1.30, pregame at 2.30 and one of the keys of the pregame is Ness's Don Rosillo from Smithfield. Don, what a day for baseball. This is great. You know, we had a great opening day uh, to begin the year in Philadelphia, but this is actually warmer here at Fenway Park, so especially the winter we just had, this, is, this couldn't be any better. And they're playing pretty well. Coming in yeah. four and two, looking pretty good. Take it two out of three in Philly and then two out of three uh, at the Yankees. Yeah, you're trying to win series. You know, that's the key. That's one thing we found out last year. They were not winning series. And this year they are. You know, you end up winning, take it two out of three from Philly, two out of three from New York. So uh, you got to like the first time through the rotation. Last night, Clay Buckholz certainly had a hiccup, uh, no doubt about that. But uh, this team is really so far fun to watch and they're fun to be around. And Rick Porcillo will take the hill today. Really had a decent outing in his first outing despite getting the loss. Yeah, he gave up a three run home run to Jeff Frank. It was a bad pitch. It was kind of a, a breaking ball that leaked on him a little bit. But other than that, he pitched very well. And of course, he's coming off signing a, a big contract and going to be here for the next four years, which uh, should be good. But I think he'll be good today against this Nationals team. You've been a part of many opening days here, and you'll be a part of the festivities that kick off at 2 30 on Nesson. Uh, what is it like opening day to be here? There's nothing like it, you know what I mean? I think my favorite opening day over the years is probably 2005 after winning the championship in 2004, and they had the whole ring ceremony here. We've had three ring ceremonies here. As it turns out in the last 10 years, but every opening day is special. Just to see this place packed as always, and to, to know that winter is behind us is is huge. And to begin another season, you have a sneak peek on any anything that we can kind of look forward to today. I know they they always have something up their sleeve. Yeah, you know I have not seen a script yet. Usually they they don't give us the script till right before we go out there, so I'm not sure what's going to be happening. But I know that they do a great job, and there's always a few special things here that take place during uh, the opening ceremonies. They do a great job of that. All right, Smithfield's Don Orsillo. Right, Joe, thank, thank you so much. Appreciate Join us. We appreciate it. That's the latest here at Allison. We'll have the latest tonight at 5 and 6 on NBC 10. Reporting live from Boston, I'm Joe Kayata, Sports Team 10.